Hello children. Welcome to our Max class. Today let us learn about solid shapes. Solid shapes is also known as 3D shapes that is three dimensional shapes which we can touch and feel. In the previous class we learned about plane shapes which we cannot take it in a hand and which has no thickness. These 3D shapes we can take it in a hand, we can feel its thickness. 3D shapes has faces, edges and corners. What is a face? Face is the surface. The plain surface of the solid object is called its face. Where the two faces meet, there forms an edge. And where the two edges meet, there forms a corner. Okay, let us move to the solid shapes now. Our first shape is cube. Cube is formed when we place six equal square pieces together. You have seen a Rubik's Cube. Yes, all the faces are equal in size. That is, each and every face is a square. So, we can say a cube has six equal flat faces. And it has 12 edges and 8 corners. Next. You can see these examples also. Coming to the cuboid, a cuboid has six flat faces. See how the cuboid is made? It is made with a rectangle. So we cannot say that it has equal faces. And then a cuboid has 12 edges and 8 corners. Observe these examples. Now coming to cylinder, a cylinder has two flat faces, which is at the top and the bottom, and one curved face that is the middle part of the cylinder, and two edges where these curved face and flat face meet. And there are no corners for a cylinder. See these examples. Now coming to spear. A spear has one curved face. That it is round in shape. It has only one curved face. There are no edges or no corners. A cone. A cone has one flat face and one curved face. Also, it has one edge and one vertex. Now, I hope all have understood what are solid shapes. Here let us draw the solid shapes. First is cube. As you know a cube is made of six equal square pieces. So first let me draw a square. Here one square is completed. Now, let us draw the other square, leaving one line and drawing the next square. Now, let us join the corners of the both squares. Yes, 
our cube is ready now. So let us count the faces, edges and corners. The flat places that is called the faces. There are six faces in a cube. There are twelve edges and eight corners. The corners also can be called as vertex. A cube has six equal flat faces. Now let us draw a cuboid. As you know, a cuboid is made with rectangle. Same like cube, I am drawing two rectangles here. Okay, now let me join these corners of these rectangles to make a cuboid. Yeah, our cuboid is ready now. So let us count the faces, edges and corners of the cuboid. Same like cube, a cuboid also has six faces. Now when I counted, I got 12 edges. And the meeting points, there are 8 points. So, 8 corners. You can see this now. Now coming to cylinder. Let us see how to draw a cylinder now. To draw the cylinder, I am going to draw two straight lines. Yes. Now, let me join these straight lines with a circle. Or we can say it as round circular face. So, a cylinder has one curved face that is the middle part and two flat face. Flat face. So, totally we have three faces for a cylinder. And the faces where they meet, these three faces where they meet in two places. So, it is two edges. And it has no corners or vertex. Now, let us move to cone. Cone, I have drawn already for you. A cone has one curved face. The upper part is the curved face and the lower part is the circular flat face. So one flat face. Totally we have two faces for a cone. And the places where the face meet is the edge. So, it has only one edge. And this place, this is the corner or vertex. Usually, for a cone, we used to say only vertex. We don't say it as a corner. So, now coming to spear. A spear is the round part. That is the, it has only one face. It is circular face. So, one curved face. It has no edge or no corner. 
So I can say it as zero edge and zero corner. I hope all have understood how to draw the 3D shapes. Thank you.